Right now, we are counting down to the next big space launch from our coast. On Monday, the United Launch Alliance will send its next generation Vulcan rocket to the moon. News 6's James Barovero is on the space coast with the preps ahead of liftoff. A new rocket here at the Cape rolled out to the launch pad for its first mission. And Vulcan Centaur isn't just going to orbit. United Launch Alliance's new heavy launcher is carrying the first American spacecraft that would land on the moon in more than 50 years. John Thornton is the CEO of the company that built the lunar lander. John Astrobotic, you're from Pittsburgh. Not only must you be enjoying our Florida winter, the real business why you're here, of course, how does it feel to be on the verge of making history? There's never been a commercial spacecraft to land on the moon. It's incredibly exciting. This is 16 years in the making, and here we are on the launch pad, ready to go for flight to the surface. It's exciting, it's, it's uh, humbling, it's, uh, it's just so amazing to be in this moment at this time. As we've been reporting here at News 6, this mission is really a precursor for the Artemis program, for NASA to put boots on the moon eventually. How will your uncrewed lander help NASA achieve that long-term goal? Well, we are the tip of the spear of our return to the surface of the moon as a nation. This will be among the first missions to return to the surface in nearly 50 years since Apollo. Um, so this will help pave the way, start to do science and, and a little bit of exploration to understand more about the surface of the moon, more about the environment. And in an update this afternoon, ULA continues to report the launch is scheduled for 2.18 in the morning on Monday. Our coverage will continue Sunday night on News 6 and ClickOrlando.com. In Cape Canaveral, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results News 6. Thank you, James. And you can get the biggest stories from the Space Coast sent directly to your inbox every Monday. James compiles the biggest stories and sends them right to you. You can sign up right now for our Space Coast and Beyond newsletter at clickorlando.com newsletters.